Thank you so much for joining us on this Tuesday evening. Only on nine tonight, dozens of area United Way agencies may have to cut their budgets 15 to 20 percent. That is because the amount of money coming in through the annual campaign is shrinking. Yeah, that's right. Nine on your mm -hmm. sides. Tom McKee has been looking into this. He's live right now with the reasons for the possible cuts. Tom. Well, here are some numbers. First, there are over 140 agencies for the United Way in greater Cincinnati that uh, serve 300,000 people in Ohio, Kentucky, Indiana. One of the main goals, of course, is to help reduce the childhood poverty rate, which at 24 percent here is one of the highest in the nation. But basically, if the giving uh, doesn't pick up, a lot of people that really need the help just may not get it. Three-year-old Devontae Powell practiced his numbers and colors Tuesday at home in Kennedy Heights. Watching carefully were his mother, Kenesha Johnson, and caseworker, Monica DeLemos. DeLemos was provided through Every Child Succeeds, which gets $2.2 million a year from United Way. Johnson says the regular visits have made a huge difference. Learned his colors by the age of two, sung his ABCs by one and a half, so with the help of Every Child Succeeds, He's been doing great. But President Judith Van Ginkle says every child succeeds budget could be cut 15 to 20 percent. That could be $440,000 less to serve 2,200 families in Ohio, Kentucky, and Indiana. You either see fewer families, and this is not just limited to us, or the other philanthropic community steps up and puts more money in, but there's a limit to what that can do, too. That's not the kind of news Johnson and her son want to hear. If they do cut back, I think most kids won't be ready for preschool because this program is a head start to get them prepared for preschool. United Way took in $62 million in 2015 and is projected to see $52 million in revenue this year. The agency's new president and CEO is Michael Johnson, who cites several reasons for the decline. One, uh, there was a tax code change this year that's going to have a uh, $17.2 billion impact on um, giving this year. Plus, several local firms were bought by venture capitalists and other charities are raising money all year long. All this comes while the economy and stock market are up. And so we have to begin to pivot. Uh, our workplace campaigns have been great. Uh, for this community, and we got to start strategizing and looking at how we raise money year round. Now, Van Ginkle says basically the focus of our agency is not going to change. It's going to help kids in the first three years of life, no matter what the budget. The goal for United Way, again, projected to be $52 million. The final total is due to be released on November 14th. Tom McKee, not on your side in Walnut Hill.